Hello everybody, SPSO here, and welcome back to Minecraft PlayStation 1 Edition. Now, we're gonna actually be starting a proper survival world this time. Uh, last time we explored the tutorial world, and we saw something at the end of it, so I'm not gonna edit this much. So, this will be a long-form video, it'll be like a mini live stream. Uh, because I don't want to miss anything, and if I don't see something while I'm editing or while I'm filming, I'm gonna probably cut it out, and I don't want to do that. <laughs> and I know it can be really easy to miss this, because I almost missed the thing that followed me. Apparently, that was there, like, frames before I saw it. <laughs> so yeah, it's gonna be really easy to miss. Don't mind these worlds, they were just me testing and making sure everything would work. So... I didn't actually find anything, really. Oh, this is the wrong thing to be changing. On survival. Uh, allow cheats. I'll leave off for now. I'll right, we'll turn on bonus chests, just so we have a few items to start off with. So we're not immediately just starting with crap. And, yes, I am playing with keyboard and mouse right now. Because I wanted to show that this can be played with keyboard and mouse. And also because I forgot to grab the cords for my controller when I started. I was just like, you know what? We're just going to start. <laughs> so we're going to call it uh, recording as a reminder. And we're going to create the world. I don't know how much of this stuff you're going to see. It's, it's currently showing me a prepare for world creation. Do not turn off system screen. Uh, for you guys, it seems to be just showing the Create New World screen. Which is weird. And very odd. I don't know why it's showing two different screens. Maybe they didn't implement the screens here correctly. Maybe. That's entirely possible. Who knows? Either way, uh, we're going to be doing this. And I'm going to play this like a normal survival world. That is something they recommend. Play this like you're playing normal Minecraft and are playing in our ARG. Treat it like an ARG. That is what they said. So, we're going to treat this like an ARG. And we're going to have some fun with it. <laughs> so yeah, this is going to be very interesting. I might... I might do roleplay shit on this later. Who knows? Either way, it'll be fun. I have a lot of ideas. I'm giving... I'm getting so many ideas from this, in all honesty. <laughs> this is such a cool mod pack. I love this. There are so many ideas it's giving me. Especially the shader. I want to use the shader for other things. I want to, like, take the shader out of this and, like, use it for all sorts of other things. Just because it looks so good. So crisp. So clean. So unique. Also, this loading screen is very nice. I like the rotating grass block. Why has Minecraft never actually had that? Why has Minecraft never had a loading screen like this? This is, like, the perfect Minecraft loading screen. Also, I know I'm rambling on. Um, it's because I decided I, <laughs> I, I, I died. I'm having some kind of autistic moment. Don't mind me. <laughs> I am legitimately, like, feeling extremely energetic. I've been drinking a lot of water today. I have a new water bottle thing that I've been trying. Loading Overworld. So if you hear me take a drink, it's from my new water bottle. Ah, oh, there's the there's the chest. No, oh, I can just push extract and it'll give me it all. The beauty of the fact that quirk is in here. We instantly have torches and everything. Ah, uh, yes. This type of graphics really fits the Minecraft music. Oh, I should stop. Toggle sprint. Okay, we're gonna gather some wood real quick. And then we're gonna, we're gonna do the normal Minecraft shit. We all know the normal Minecraft routine. Get wood. Get tools. Go mining. We going mining, boys. I actually wonder if the dweller is in here. 
There's a lot of mods in this. There's like a hundred something mods. Which shocks me, because it feels like normal Minecraft, but just a little different. But no, it's like a hundred something mods. It's very surprising how well you can hide mods. Like, if you really try, you can hide mods, like, in plain sight. It's very nice. I swear, it's like the ultimate vanilla plus. Like, you got a good vanilla plus mod pack with a little bit of, like, horror and shit. Just get this. You're good. Hello, I see. Oh yeah, you guys will be able to see it way better because of because of the graphics and everything. There's a there's an iron there. I don't actually need to put down as many torches because this has better uh, graphics for YouTube to try and render. But I'm gonna put down a torch. Oh yes, the beauty of this. God, the mouse is so sensitive. I'm an idiot. I don't know why I put that down. I need to I need to craft a crafting table. Don't mind me, I'm being absent-minded and not paying attention to what the fuck I'm doing. Brain go burr today. Apparently I have a lot more energy right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am very, very sorry. Uh, how did I make that? I'm fucking stupid. I have a fucking stone pick right here. I'm so used to just making a wooden pickaxe first thing. Uh, that 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 is just that is just habit. That is just habit showing itself. That is all that is. There is no excuse for that. that that's just stupid habit. I'm not I'm not exactly used to starting with the uh, starter gear, so that's actually a nice change for me, I guess. You know, starter gear is not normally something you start with, and I'm not used to that. I forgot that I basically gave myself an easier start than normal. Because I'm used to doing everything in, like, the proper orders. Ooh, iron. Gimme. I don't know how well you guys are going to be able to see. Like, in post, I don't know how uh, YouTube compression is going to uh, affect. Uh, but you guys should have a pretty clear view of when it's dark. I think. Namely because of just this shader's fucking effects. There's an iron down there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to it, though. There's a creeper guarding it. Alright. Um... I guess... We're gonna have to deal with night soon. I have to deal with night soon. Do you guys hear that? I don't know if- I don't know how well my mic is picking it up, but I just heard, like, some brock blocks breaking somewhere. I always said brocks breaking, and I'm just like, what? Where the fuck did I land? Oh, I landed back where I mined the other iron. Watch me fall for that hole like three other times. <laughs> gonna be so fucking stupid if I do. Ha! Can't fall through it now. Fucker. That's a very weird being Steve again. Like, if I have five. I'm just Steve. There's no F5 for looking forward, which is going to be very weird. Uh, but yeah, I'm just Steve. And... I don't know, that has like an eerie vibe to it. I don't know. The fact that I have my like skin active, but it's not actually showing. I don't know, it feels off. It feels off to be Steve. Especially with these graphics and the like fog rendering reminiscent of Herobrine pictures. <laughs> like, quite literally, this is just the fog level of Herobrine. Although, this would be the fog rendering level if Minecraft was made for the PS1. 
which is a very interesting concept in and of itself. The entire reasoning for this pack existing is an interesting concept. Because just like the, the person who made this was just like, hey, what if Minecraft was made for the PlayStation 1? And they started looking at like old PS1 games that had 3D graphics and doing the warping effect that they used to have. And Colt, hello. That was the other thing I was going to have to find. Don't got to find that anymore. That's useful. I'm going to gather a little bit more stone, though. But yeah, there's a lot of weird, like, details that they put into this, and I love it. And hello. I'm going to cook up some iron and get some wool from you. Maybe I can get a bed easy. My friend Kelsey has been looking for sheep on their world for so long, and they didn't find any. And here I am, finding sheep immediately. Okay, we're gonna put... Coal in. Cook it up. I just need two iron. You know, we're gonna make a second furnace. That's because I feel like that's gonna be beneficial. Right now. We don't have much daylight to burn. So might as well. Of course, gonna make shears. And there we go, we have shears. Where are you, sheep? Come here. Snip, snip. Did you only give me one wool? They gave me two. Where are your brethren? I refuse to believe that there are only two of you. If there are only two of you, could you please just start eating grass? Like a motherfucker? Okay, we're gonna pick this up. We're gonna pick this up. We're gonna eat. Once this coal dries, once this furnace stops burning, I'll move on. Would one of you two eat so they can actually make a bed real quick? I don't know, I might actually make a base around here because it's actually a decent little area. Got caves and stuff. Oh, yeah, I'll just make a base right here. Why the hell not? We have sheep nearby. We can get as much wool as we want. Also, I read somewhere in the list of things you can do on this, you can, like, slap, um, slap banners under your beds, so I might actually want sheep nearby. So that sounds very beneficial. In case I decide I actually want to decorate. I know, me decorating. I didn't think it was possible either. But uh, decorating actually doesn't sound that bad. In all honesty. Well, it's not in this. Because this, I'm curious what things look like. <laughs> With the shader. Also, I keep forgetting that I'm getting XP every time I'm crafting. Which feels so fucking weird. Yeah, which spot do I want to... I'll build into this nice flat area over here. Plenty of room to expand. We're going to start as everyone is, everyone always starts and build up from there. Like everyone always used to, you know? You know, like you start building and then you just build off of that build. Make it look nice later. Something quick and dirty for the night. Shit. There was a grass piece in the way. Oh, shit. I had to get a roof on this. I don't know if phantoms can spawn immediately or not. Which is entirely possible. I wouldn't put it past them. <laughs> to just, you know, remove the whole phantom timer and instead just say, fuck it. They just exist.
Am I really about to run out of wood after chopping that much? No, I have 25 more planks. Okay. Good. There we go. Grab this. We're just going to set all this up. Hello, Zom. What does that sound? Oh no, they did remove the phantom timer. No! And I know phantoms in this. I actually do know phantoms in this. Shit. Sheep, you rigor your wool. You're not fuck me over. Ow. Just gonna whack you a few times. Come on, you undead cucks. Oh, God. I can hear the phantoms. I need more wood. Fuck. Alright, looks like it's gonna have to be acacia wood for now. Come on, you creeper bitch. Die. Die, you zombie bastard. Uh, I hate zombies. I hate zombies, I hate creepers, I hate all the Minecraft mobs. They're assholes. We'll patch ourselves with the acacia wood for now, and we'll, rep we'll replace it later. Fuck you. Okay, patch the holes, patch the holes. Okay. That is done. Three doors works. Okay, we're gonna go with you know. Let's we we normally go with white. Let's go with gray. Let's sleep, and it fades to pure black whenever you sleep. That's kind of ominous. Oh motherfucker! Of course it's raining. Anyway, we have a chest at least. We can drop some of our shit in here. Oh my god, someone just drove by like their fucking life depended on it. Uh, I need... You know what? I'll make a stone sword. Why the hell not? Alright, so... We have some defense... Go get more wood and shit. And that's a creeper! Ooh, he gave me an iron shovel. That'll be useful. Oh, you know what I should do? I should make an iron... Um, I should make a stone axe. Little zombie bastard. I'm just gonna plant some trees around so we can get more oak wood. In all honesty, I kind of don't like Acacia. At least not for this build. Unless maybe I use it as an accent block? Maybe, actually. That might be a nice use of it. 
Hmm. Yeah, a little, little bit of a cage here all around, like, the rims and around, like, the edges and stuff. That might be good. That might be good. I'm, I, I, I see a possibility of using a cage here. A little bit. Not a lot, though. I'm not going to use it, like, a ton. The main base block is probably going to be wood and or cobblestone. But an acacia mortar might be nice. We're going to keep it very simple with the house build, though. I'm thinking. If only because I like the aesthetic with this one. Will this mod pack the aesthetic of just a simple house? Looks really nice. Because of the graphics. Oh, uh, and my cat has come to see me. My cat has decided to perch on my arm. Why are you perching on my arm, cat? <laughs> I'm in the middle of a recording, bud. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you guys can hear him. Is he purring loud enough? Here. You're not purring loud enough. You're not gonna purr for the camera. Hi, brat. My cat is literally on my lap right now. God, I've lost track of where my house is. Shit. Oh, there it is. Oh, don't sit on my keyboard. <laughs> you brat. My cat has decided it is snuggle time. <laughs> Whether I like it or not. I will now be cuddled with my cat the entire time for this playthrough. Of all the times for you to just randomly do that, you do it during a recording, bud. Wow. You are a little brat. Can't be needy. I want comments saying that Taz, that Taz is a needy cat. Tease him in the comments. Yeah, I'll give you guys a little bit of a... <laughs> I don't know how well you guys could pick that up. <laughs> Oh, that's stupid, but he's being a little brat. Yes, Fuzzy. I can't take my hands off the keyboard, bud. Yes, hello. You're a brat. Anyway, I... <laughs> anyway, I do think that this is a long enough uh, video. We have a bit of a house. We have some iron cooking up. I'm gonna get rid of this fucking leaf shit here. Uh, I need to find more wood for the floor. Actually, maybe we'll make an acacia floor. Maybe. Uh, but we'll see next episode. If everyone did enjoy, if you was join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, don't forget to shoot the like button, slay those comments, and contain that subscribe button. Anyway, guys, I'll see you on the next video, live stream, or whatever next. I'm gonna go pet my cat since he's decided it's snuggle time. Peace, guys!